guys, Ralph here, and welcome to True Power Trumpet Fitness on Terrific Tuesday. I have been crazy since I last saw you on Friday. I didn't get anything up yesterday, and yesterday was nuts, good nuts, and uh, good nuts. And uh, But now, now, uh, here I am, and I'm not going to be able to get anything up on Friday. I'll explain that in a second, but here we are. Now. You saw the thumbnail. I was talking about this ad nauseum with several of my students, and I guess it's, up, it's me. It's me, because a lot of my students are getting the wrong idea. Guys, there has to be some work done. Okay? Let me honk a little bit, and, and I'll, I'll tell you what I'm talking about. Okay? As usual, first notes of the day. Veggie juice for the win. Anyway, Friday, I can't get anything up. Guys, it's going to be today, tomorrow, and Thursday. Can't get anything up. Uh, got to go down to Delaware, visit a law school with my daughter. She got a free ride to Delaware Law, man. <laughs> and we're going to go check it out, and she's going to get a tour of the campus and all this sort of stuff. And uh, so that's that. So we got today, tomorrow, Thursday. We'll talk again on Monday. All right. Anyway, uh, yes, I will have the laptop there as usual. Okay. So I can send you books. I can, uh, you know, take orders for uh, mouthpieces, the whole nine yards. I will have, you know, uh, access to social media. Anyway, guys, look. This one's on me. This one's on me. How many times have I said, you know, if you don't have a double C, you're doing something wrong, that this one's on me, okay? Because a lot of my students have the exact same issues and language, language uh, eludes me. It, it, it doesn't do its proper work to make you feel what I'm feeling. Guys, you saw the thumbnail. There has to be some work done. There has to be. And I put a, 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 a video of Lynn Nich uh, thumbnail of Lynn Nicholson. Guys, the compression that guy developed, whether you like his tone or not, I get a lot of this stuff. But the compression that that guy develops, and whether doing what mouthpiece is doing, that's not the point. But the pressure that guy produces within his torso is otherworldly. Otherworldly. And I sit here and I say, God, I'm hardly holding the horn, uh, which is true. There's not a mark on my lip. How many times have I said that? Which is all true. But guys, it's not like I'm sitting there. Um, guys, that does not give you a double C. If you're going to play like that, just completely relaxed with no work whatsoever in the torso. Get yourself a one and a quarter C and a C trumpet because that's what you got. You'll be struggling for a decent high C your whole life. That's what you got. Guys, in order to do this, there has to be some work. Now, what makes it so easy for us, I'm telling you, is that we transfer that stress to the rest of the body. So it doesn't seem like you're working that hard. Guys, but I'm doing kettlebells here with 50-pound kettlebells, which is not even that, that heavy as far as the kettlebell goes. But guys, that is work. Something is working. And just like the trumpet, the kettlebells transfer via hyper-irradiation. I've talked about this before. 
hyper irradiation, it transfers it to the rest of the body that it doesn't seem like a whole lot of work. Okay, and it has to be done a certain way, blah, blah, blah. Okay, but guys, there has to be some work done. And I talked about Adolf Scherbaum. I know I've talked about this before. That he somehow calibrated the compression inside his mouth to be that of an automobile tire. Guys, I don't know if I buy that. And I've said it every single time. There's an enormous amount of compression inside his mouth. An automobile tire, I don't know. I don't know. The compression I am developing inside my mouth is not, I can guarantee you, is not that of an automobile tire. Anyway, myth, legend, the reason I say it, guys, and I use him all the time, is that it's not just sitting there, la, la, no, it's not. And sometimes when the chops feel great, the double C's come flying out, but guys, hyperirradiation, proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation, guys, why do you think I have you pleading with you? to get the SFE book and the kettlebell for, for double C's. Because that's what takes all of the strain off the chops. Okay? Now, I'm going to say something here, okay? And don't take it the wrong way. Okay? Don't take it the wrong way. Okay? I am not saying I'm a better trumpet player than Wayne Bargeron. I am not saying I have a better trumpet player than Arturo Sandoval. But look at those mangled lips on those two. I am infinitely better at taking the stress off these beloved lips than they are. That doesn't mean I better... I'm not saying that. Stop it. I'm, I'm just going to delete you. If, if, if you want to have any say in, this, in these comment sections... Don't go there. That's not what I'm saying. Okay? What I'm saying is, am I take having less work on my uh, pressure and damage to my chops, on my double C's and whatnot, than some of the greatest players that ever lived? Yes. That's what I'm saying, and I have no problem saying that. By hyper-irradiation, by the kettlebells, blah, blah, blah. Okay? There has to be some work done. Now, I'm going to get a little morbid here, okay? But it does accentuate every single thing I'm trying to play. Our beloved Jerome Callet, guys, the last six months of his life, even though he was still teaching, even though he was still, still selling mouthpieces, even so he, so he was still spit buzzing hours a day, he could not play the trumpet anymore. Why? Because he was too weak. His heart could not take it. The, the, the um, doctors came right out and told him if he played again, he would probably drop dead. That's why I have his trumpet. He was done with the trumpet. He gave the trumpet to me. Guys, that's because he could not transfer that compression to the rest of his body. His body wouldn't have held up. You see what I'm saying? So when I have, you know, trumpet players, students that are sitting there barely playing, I, I, I don't, I don't want to strain. Guys, <laughs> guys, that's firm. That is firm. This is relaxed. <laughs> nothing to do with it. That is relaxed. And that double C that I'm just oohing and ah uh, about seven minutes ago, I was barely holding the horn. It was locked in like you wouldn't believe. I was working. The compression that you make inside your mouth has to be supported by the rest of the body and transferred via hyperradiation to make it easier. Now, Am I playing double C's easier than just about all of our idols? Yes. That doesn't make me better than them. Stop it. <laughs> okay? Stop it. All right? Got it? Okay.
eat and drink your fruits and vegetables and live your... Oh, one more thing. Guys, that does not mean you play all 10 step. This, the compression here, will designate how much you have to support. Perfect example. Okay? Nothing. Now, I'm going to completely 100% tighten up my core and do the same thing. It's no difference. This, the hyperreation of what has to be transferred, is directly calibrated by what you produce up here. All right? We got it? Guys, comments below. Eat and drink fruits and vegetables and live your life with true power. Love you all.